We set up camp last night here at Nanga Mill in the Lanepool Reserve near Dwelling Up. Now is the time to actually sit back and enjoy all the hard work that's gone into Eeyore. I could have replaced the original equipment with high performance gear straight out, but I'm so glad that I actually took the extra time to check and test and replace any faulty wiring or fuses. That ensures that all my brand new iTech World equipment works perfectly. We all have our own priorities when it comes to power vampires. Whether it's cooking toast, making pancakes, or fresh coffee, maybe even drying your hair. It's all possible thanks to the powerful iTech World 2000 watt inverter. Keep in mind, you can have two very similar items. However, they may draw significantly different power rates. This larger hairdryer is 2200 watts, whilst this little guy is a meager 1000. And that's really important when you're considering the capacity of your inverter. So, my best advice, always check. Even if you have lower rated equipment, the rules always stay the same. First check each appliance to make sure it runs at a lower wattage than your inverter. And remember, although your inverter might happily deliver the correct watts required for an appliance, it relies on the capacity and amp hours stored in the battery to provide power. Which is why I'm actually doing an overnight run before doing a larger camping trip. You see, I want to work out and understand exactly how much power I can use without having the freezer defrost. Of course, with 240 amp hours stored in the iTech 120X Pros and a 300 watt solar panel topping up those batteries, I'm not expecting to be sitting in the dark tonight. Even after spending the afternoon providing the crew with coffee and pancakes, recharging the e-bike, my iPad and my camera, and of course, heating up a hot chocolate for an after dinner treat, my batteries still have plenty of power to spare. I'm gonna sleep easy tonight because tomorrow I can get up and do it all again. You see, as soon as the sun's up, my solar panels are gonna to be topping my batteries up. I gotta to say, I really love my new electrical system. <laughs>